So, Chef, we, we discussed the uh, Farad and Wajib yesterday, and some of the schools of thought, like, like the, the Hanafi school of thought, they, they classify Wicca as, as Wajib, and it was just clarification on that, the difference between Wajib and Farad, the different schools of thought. Okay, uh, also we discussed, the second question, we discussed Wajib and Farad, and we and the Hanafis, they say that Wicca is Wajib. So can you clarify that and the difference between the schools of thoughts on Wajib and Farad? No. One question, Sheikh, is the question of the difference between Farad and Wajib? We found that the Hanafi, for example, Wajib. The second, the third, 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 حقيقة لا يوجد فرق بين الفرض والواجب عند الجمهور إنما الفرق عند الحنفية الحنفية يفرقون بين الفرض والواجب أما الجمهور الفرض هو واجب ويساوي الواجب والفرق عند الحنفية يفرقون من حيث أنهم يقولون الفرض ما ثبت بدليل قطعي ما ثبت وجوبه بدليل قطعي وأما الواجب فما ثبت دليله بدليل ظني قالوا مثال ذلك الفرائض الخمس قالوا هذه تعتبر فرض لكن الوتر والأضحية عندهم تعتبر واجب تسمى واجب ليس فرض لماذا؟ لأنها لم تثبت بدليل قطعي وإنما ثبتت بدليل ظني Okay, now with regards to the difference between فرض and واجب then the جمهور of the scholars they don't have a distinction between them generally speaking the distinction is made with the in the Hanafi madhab or the scholars of uh, the Hanafi madhab, and the difference between them, according to them, is that the fard they use fard for something which is the obligation of it is affirmed by an evidence which is qat'i. Whereas wajib is something which is affirmed by an evidence which is considered dhanni. It's not qat'i. So they will say Salawat al Khams, the obligation of the five daily prayers is called Fard. And Witr, they will say, is called Wajib. Why? Because the Salawat al Khams is affirmed by a Dalil which is Qat'i. We spoke about Dalil which is Qat'i before, Dalil which is Dhani, but it, that also takes more uh, explanation. Al Qat'i is the difference between the Dalil Qat'i and the Dalil Dhani. يعني الدليل الذي مثل كما قلنا ضربنا مثال بالفرائض الخمس نعم. دليلها قطعي لا يحتمل الاختلاف لكن الظني لا المسألة الدليل يعني ليس بذلك القوة ولذلك في خلاف بين العلماء نعم. So basically the difference is uh, that a delil qatti, evidence which is qatti, it's not something where there's any difference of opinion, it's not possible for there to be difference of opinion, whereas the delil which is dhanni, it's possible for there to be difference of opinion amongst the scholars. So that's why they make a distinction between farad and wajib. Are you struggling to find an organized way of studying? Too many webinars and no direct study route? Well, why not study with Medina College Online? Starting your journey is easy. With a simple registration system, you will be studying in no time. To find out more, visit www.mclportal.com and sign up today.